Hello, fellow Sunonians. I'm Feline Music, and I wanted to show you 10 Suno tips I find helpful for creating music. Tip number one, listen to some music. Sounds simple, isn't that simple? The best way is to browse the Suno website, because there, you already see the genres and prompts they used. You can even click on the genres to find similar songs, but it's also okay to just listen to regular music. You need to get an ear for music. If you want to know a genre of a song, you can easily ask ChatGPT or a site called Sono Teller. Link is in the description. This helps a lot with genre picking or getting the direction for your song in mind. Tip number two, experiment. Experiment a lot. This is something that will eat your credits itself, but helps reduce them when you make songs. For example, you want Combine House with jazz. You don't know how it sounds? Try it out. Experiments is something that will teach you Suno itself. Make whole songs about experimenting. Not just genres, but also voices or prompts. See what is working. For example, pregnant pause is a prompt. Wink. Tip number three, connect yourself and ask other users. The Suno main Discord server is a good source. Not only good discussions are happening there, you can ask if you have a problem. I don't recommend to ask other Suno creators below their video for advice. On this video, feel free to ask questions in the comment section. For help, Google is useful, but be careful there is also some wrong information and fake Suno websites. Also a side note, many users are creators themselves. Don't spam people with your songs and accept if someone doesn't have the time for it. No one is obligated to listen to your songs. If you make good songs and keep building up, the listeners and fans come by themselves. Tip number four, sometimes simpler is easier. I say this as someone who uses a lot of genre prompts, but you can get lost in them. Let Suno sometimes take the flow. This is hard to learn because we often have a vision or an understanding of our songs. Suno can be moody, so give it more room. If you chomp too much on a song, it can be frustrating. A good rule is one to two main genres, one subgenre and vocals. This tend to get better results. Tip number five, if you are stuck, try something new. Creativity can sometimes flow and sometimes you are blocked. It helped to try something completely new. If you only make metal but got stuck, try to make electro pop. This helps against blocked minds and you will gain new experience. P.S. Don't hate on genres. Tip number six, keep track on everything. If you write your own lyrics, safe them down. If you want to make a whole album, look what you already have done. It's important to keep you structured so you remember things. Useful prompts, genres that you wanted to use, or another song you liked. Not only can you look up if you missed something, it's way better to learn this way. Tip number seven, all about the lyrics. Song structures help Suno to understand when comes what. The most important ones are of course verse, chorus, bridge. This helps to give the song itself a structure. There are also some more like intro, pre-hook, and outro. I will explain them more in a future video. Another thing is, here you can get great use of ChatGPT. It's no shame to make lyrics over it. The only thing is, it can sound generic. The more time you give to a lyrics, the more it will be fleshed out. Write a story and then tell ChatGPT to make a lyrics out of it, and then you already have a unique song text. If you write songs like me, ChatGPT can help to give the lyrics some structure. Maybe you search a word or want to translate a section. All very helpful. Tip number eight. Since you generate multiple versions every time, it can always be useful to still press the Create button multiple times. I know it's hard if you want to save credits, but if you don't like the two you just created, often you have to wait. Give Suno time to generate while you listen to the first ones. Tip number nine, use thumb ups and thumb downs in your own library. Give the songs you like, and maybe consider a like and the ones who are terrible a thumbs down not only already gives you three categories to sort, you find the ones you want to use easier. Three categories, you asking. Well, the middle ones who are not liked or thumbed down are also a category. Maybe you can reuse some of it so you don't waste credits for a future. Little 9.1 tip, give your song creations names, especially if you use extend a lot. So you keep track on it and can easier search it Let's say the main song is test one, two, three. Then you name the extend test 2.2, 2.2, 2.3, 2.4, 2.5, 2.6, 2.7, 2.8, 2.9, 2.10, 2.11, 2.12, 2.13, 2.14, 2.15, 2.16, 2.17, 2.18, 2
2.3, etc. helps much with organizing. Tip number 10. At first, Suno is a hobby. Take your time. Don't go with the goal to make easy money or just to make you famous. Not only is that the wrong mindset, but also many others got that idea. It's already cool we have an AI that can make music. Your own written words into songs. Your mind having an idea into a serenade. Thank you everyone for listening until now. This could be a future series. You can share your own tips and tricks in the comments. I will also make a question and answering video in the future, so you can ask your questions as well. Be creative and inspiring. Of course, you're welcome to browse other videos of mine. Feline over and out.